Well, I had to bring everybody back in because it started raining. But now I got to clean the van. Well, everybody's relaxing. I got the van clean and now some dinner. What we're having for dinner tonight is squash, zucchini, onions, a little bit of bacon. When this is cooked up, I'm going to fry a couple of eggs and throw over the top of it. And that's dinner. What's going on, guys? Anyway, it is uh, later in the evening now. After dinner, I wanted to test out my... Uh, I wanted to see and make sure my alternator is working right. I'm still puzzled why my batteries went bad, the first ones. But uh, so I was going to just unhook my uh, positive cables with it running if it dies that means your alternator is not putting out enough charge but um so before i started it i went out to loosen up the cables a little bit and i sparked the wrench on, i i think i might have hit the side of the van i'm not sure but uh boy a big spark came out scared the right out of me you know what word i was going to say there but yeah it scared me pretty good uh because of my pacemaker and so uh yeah i definitely scared myself uh so i've called the pacemaker company they've put me put me through to the doctor that put my pacemaker in i'm waiting on the call back it'll probably be tomorrow but uh i didn't feel a shock or anything and i've talked to a, a, a friend of mine that's a nurse and she said she doubted uh, you know she really doubts that uh that would do anything uh but yeah i didn't feel nothing but the spark was big i mean like I literally scared the t out of myself, but um, I'm not gonna mess with batteries no more. I'm gonna just have somebody do it. Cause I don't, you know, I, I know that I, when I looked it up online, what was funny is I looked it up on Google and it said, long as you're careful, <laughs> but it didn't say if, you know, you maybe ground out your ranch or something, you know, it didn't say anything, but it said cell phones, microwaves, uh, even electric blankets is not good to have. Uh, with your pacemakers so yeah it was uh, I was like okay yeah um, I better call but yeah I think everything's fine they didn't sound too stressed about it when I called uh, Boston Scientific that's who makes the pacemaker so waiting on a call back from my cardiologist and we'll see so as far as the van goes everything seems to be going good with the van I can't wait for the meetup in June I was gonna go stay at some uh, local campgrounds but i'm just gonna save my money uh gas is going up in prices and food is going up it's just like man it, it it takes serious budgeting to make it right now but uh that's all right it is what it is uh you know uh i had fun on the live uh i did today with you guys this morning i did a pop-up live this morning so i think what i'm gonna do once a month when i um instead of doing a Wednesday night live, I'll do a daytime live because I got to see my friends Van Life Van Gaming. Uh, so many of you that don't get to come into the, uh, there's the sun peeking out of the clouds. It's about 5.30. The sun's peeking out of the clouds for a little bit. Uh, it was snowing an hour ago, just flurries, but it was snowing. This weather's crazy. But uh, anyway, yeah, I, so I'm gonna do a pop-up live once a week uh, or once a month on one of the live, instead of doing a nighttime live that, that night on a Wednesday, and uh, just hang out with you guys for a, a, a while. It was fun. Uh, I got to see people that I haven't got to see in a while on lives, for sure. Oh, I just seen, I just got a notification that Superman and Lois is on tonight on the CW, because uh, they run a day late, I think. Uh, when it airs on the CW, it's a day late, so I'll be watching that tonight. When I go to bed, one of my favorite shows, uh, definitely, it was, it's one of the best renditions of Superman written that I, I like. It's a good series. It really is. And the guy that plays Superman is actually from uh, one of the wolves that were on Teen Wolf. He played on Teen Wolf. I forget his name on Teen Wolf, but he was a cool guy uh, and definitely a good actor. And uh, the girl that plays Lois played on Grimm. I don't know their names, but very good show if you guys haven't seen it, uh, Superman and Lois. Let's pick this video up tomorrow on the way to the YMCA. See you tomorrow. <laughs>
get my pan ready for what I'm going to have for dinner tonight so that it'll be kind of unthawed when I get back. I'm not gone that long. I'll be hungry when I get back, so I'll, uh, I'll just turn it straight on when I get here and have some dinner within the hour. We're going to have some chicken and veggies. There, that looks good. Maybe a little corn in there. All right. And we'll put a little bit of water in it and some spices. Actually, we'll just put a little pepper. see what else and maybe some Italian seasoning all right there we go and little girl hi Cleopatra <laughs> we've had this on high for 30 minutes we're gonna turn it off there we go Right, sunbathers I will see you guys when I get back whoops you almost fell didn't you I'll see you guys when I get back hey right, guys that's all for this episode I'll see you guys on the next one take care of yourselves take care of each other peace out